What happens if a husband causes a car accident and his wife or a child who is a passenger is injured? Hi, I'm attorney Scott Poisson, a Las Vegas based attorney practicing injury law for over 30 years. And I'm often confronted with this exact fact pattern. The question is whether a spouse or other family member that lives in the same household as the at fault driver can make an injury claim against the at fault driver's insurance policy. Nevada law requires that all drivers maintain auto insurance. And in Nevada, drivers must maintain a minimum of $25,000 of bodily injury coverage. That means that if a driver negligently injures someone else, assuming the driver followed the law, there should be at least $25,000 of coverage for the benefit of the injured person. Can an injured spouse or child make an insurance claim? An auto insurance policy is a contract and the language of the policy spells out what exactly is covered along with the amount that is covered. Most auto policies include an exclusion provision that states something similar to this. We do not provide liability coverage for any person for bodily injury to you or any family member and then defines family member as a person related to you by blood, marriage, or adoption who is a resident of your household. And generally speaking, courts across the United States have universally upheld these family exclusions. Unfortunately, what this means is that if the at-fault spouse or family member's auto policy contains a family exclusion, and most do, then the injured family member could not make a claim for insurance proceeds regardless of how severe the injury. However, don't automatically give up. Although rare, we have had some cases where the insurance policy does not include the family member exclusion. So it's worth taking a look at the policy. Secondly, Keep in mind that when there is a family member exclusion, it usually states that it is effective for residents of the insured's household. So there could be a situation where spouses no longer reside in the same household for whatever reason. In that case, the exclusion may not apply. Similarly, children that may have been injured may not reside in the same household as the parent and the exclusion may not apply. One last important point. Family member exclusions do not apply to tort liability. Generally, where the exclusion is applicable, it means that an insurance company will not pay for the injuries. However, a family member still has the option to sue his or her family member directly, and any judgment would be the responsibility of the at-fault family member, as insurance would not pay anything. I know this isn't very useful since I doubt that there are many family members that would actually pursue money damages against another family member, but you never know. And I'm simply providing that information to be intellectually honest to cover as many possible scenarios, no matter how unlikely. I hope this video provided some value to you. If so, please click like and hit subscribe to my channel and share with friends and family. Thanks for watching.